<clears throat> hey guys, so I wanted to come on here to talk about a word that Jesus Christ placed on my heart regarding the rapture. So about the rapture, um, Jesus Christ is really going to come back, but it's going to come. He's going to come back when the bride, like this is when you know he's going to come back, when the bride is without spot, blemish, or wrinkle, that's when he's really going to come back. He told me this, he revealed this to me in the spirit, and he told me that the bride will be on fire for God, like, it will be like electricity, just pure. When the bride is completely pure, that is when the Lord Jesus Christ, and on fire for him only, that's when he is going to come back for us. Also, um, he is also talking to me about the mark of the beast and how people have already sold their soul to the devil for we wrestle not against flesh and blood. And the devil knows that um, everything is going to come to an end because he knows that Jesus Christ is coming soon. So he's going to just go with the flow of, you know, of God, because God is Alpha and Omega, and he is the author. Um, the devil can lie that he is in control, but it is already finished. So he can't lie about it. Well, anyways, um... Yes, so Jesus Christ is coming back. Um, I've been confessing my sins lately, and some of the sins are very terrible, like I should be killed for the sins that I have committed. But Jesus Christ died for those specific sins for the whole entire world. So, I am now covered by the blood of Jesus. Well, anyways, I hope you guys seek first the kingdom of God and its righteousness. And this is for the bride of Christ. Um, in the Bible, Jesus Christ did not pray for the people that were in the world when he was about to get crucified. Um, when he was about to get crucified, he was praying to his father. And now they are one. Jesus Christ is God now. He was given the, um, the honor and the power. So, anywho, um, remember, for we do not wrestle against flesh and blood, but against principalities and powers of the heavenly realms, and we are seated with him in heavenly places. And he wants a holy bride. He doesn't want his bride to conform to the patterns of this world. And men shall be lovers of themselves in the end days, but that is Leviathan. Um, so, yeah, the mark of the beast is coming. Well, anyways, bye, guys, and have... A good day.